Installment of Drinks with Jay. <sighs> this week, we're drinking the College White Russian. It's actually a recipe I got from my friend's dad, Steve. Shout out to Steve. Thanks for the idea, pal. I don't know why it's uh, a White Russian, because it's, it's pretty brown, but that's what the recipe called. <laughs> uh, I made it mighty strong. That is Russian for no. It's also the only Russian word I know. Stalin. Like a sharp tone. You know? So this is just like this drink. It's perfect. It, it really describes Russia. But surprisingly, it does not taste like communism. Go figure. And, uh, yeah. It is exquisite. Um, you know... Desperate times call for desperate measures. I bought a fifth of Barton's vodka for five dollars and thirty cents. Any any vodka but this one. This one's just terrible. It is bad. It is not fun. I will never buy this vodka again. I am ashamed of Barton's and ever indulging in their product. That's quite the kick to it. What it is is three ice cubes. I use the uh, French press because I like the elegant things in life. But I love French presses. You know, really uh, blends the grounds with the water. Fun fact about coffee: it's only two percent bean. The rest of it's just water, but it tastes completely like the bean. Crazy. Who would have thought? somewhere around 12 13 dollars total uh, it tastes like 13 dollars let me tell you definitely if you're interested in this drink I would suggest a better vodka than gasoline because Barton's is shit but yeah I just got back from spring break we were down in Texas and uh, my bank account has a lot of zeros in it and it's not the good ones so it's trying to be as cheap as possible get the nastiest vodka bottom shelf plastic bottle uh, and it tastes like that but you know Steve I salute you it's a great drink with better vodka it definitely it has like this uh this mocha flavor to it and then there's this sting that comes out after it it's like gasoline Gosh. vodka oh. it's it's greasy but exquisite of course um, you know, you just, uh, you gotta like it. You know, it's got a little bit of caffeine, it'll wake you up, it's good, like, I, I feel like it's a good, like, a, a five o'clock drink, you know? Um, like, maybe you have it with, like, dinner, if you're having, like, a steak, you know? A nice, dirty white Russian. Please drink responsibly. Don't have too many white Russians. And don't get behind the wheel after one of these bad boys. Yep. That's all it is. Well, thanks for tuning in to another installment of my exquisite Drinks with Jay. Stay tuned for the rest of this week. I got two more episodes coming because I've been slacking, and I know. But as always, don't let your dreams 